No, nice straight line. No, come back. Hold on to him. Don't let him get away. My goodness. There we go. We got it. Hey, Laura and Red Cup. We come into this incredibly beautiful December morning to be united in marriage. Today is a day you will always remember the greatest in anyone's life. You'll start off the day just two people in love and end it as husband and wife. It's a brand new beginning, the start of a journey with moments to cherish and treasure. And although there'll be times when you both disagree, these will surely be outweighed by pleasure. You've heard many words of advice in the past when the secrets of marriage were spoken. But you know that the answers lie hidden inside, where the bond of true love lies unbroken. So live happy forever as lovers and friends. It's the dawn of a new life for you as you stand here together with love in your heart from the moment you whisper, I do. And with luck, all your hopes and all your dreams can be real. May success find its way to your hearts. Tomorrow can bring you the greatest of joys, but today is the day it all starts. Marriage is a beautiful and holy estate. It is the first and oldest right of the world. It was instituted in the time of man's beginning, sanctioned by the prophets and seers of the ages. Marriage is a marvelous adventure, a journey taken by two. Marriage is a commitment to live together, to love together, to celebrate together, and to work out all of the challenges of life together. Marriage is also an experience that is shared and honored by family and friends and blessed by God. It's into this time-honored tradition you've now come to be joined, so may the celebration of this very special day live long in your memory. The happiness that is made actual in this union is only made real when there is the utmost surrender of yourself and your heart to each other, because you are taking into the care and keeping the happiness of the one that you love. So let your love be very, very strong, so it overcomes all of life's obstacles. Now the big question, do you really want Take Riddick as your wife, to love, honor, and cherish her, to always speak the truth in love, and will you tenderly care for her? Yes, I do. And do you, Riddick, take Libor as your husband, to love, honor, and cherish him, to always speak the truth in love, and will you tenderly care for him? I do. That's the words we were looking for. Now, I'm going to have you let her hold this. Now, I want you two to just kind of turn, hold each other's hands. Libor, look right in her eyes and repeat after me. I, Libor. I, Libor. Take you, Radhika. Take you, Radhika. Radhika. To be my wedded wife. To be my wedded wife. And Radhika. I, Radhika. I, Radhika. Take you, Libor. Take you, Libor. To be my wedded husband. To be my wedded husband. And now will you both repeat together. To have and to hold. To, to have and to hold. hold. From this day forward. For joy and celebration. For joy and celebration. For love and understanding. For love and understanding. And here too, I pledge you my heart. I pledge you my heart. Now, tell you about these rings. By its shape, the ring symbolizes eternity, because it is an unbroken circle, without beginning or end. By its substance, the precious metal symbolizes wisdom, purity, and enduring value. So may these rings be blessed as a token of your love for one another, as you are now joined in an unbroken circle. And may your love for one another be wise, be pure, and be eternal. So we'll take this ring, slip it on her ring finger, and just repeat after me. Radka with this ring. Radka with this ring. I marry you. I marry you. Promising that our love, promising our love, will grow stronger, will grow so stronger through the passing years. Through passing years. Slide that right on. Radhika, take this ring. Libor with this ring. Libor with this ring. I marry you. I marry you. Promising that our love, promising that our love will never fail. Will never fail. Slide that. Now hold each other's hands. By the way, you two, believe it or not, weddings are easy. Marriages, on the other hand, take a little work. So 
be very, very gentle with each other and fill your home with lots of love and laughter. Libor, Rekha. Each time you look upon these lovely rings and remember this day, may they remind you of this pledge, and that is, I will never leave you nor forsake you. Set me as a seal upon your arm, set me as a seal upon your heart, for our love is strong. And wherever you go, I will go. Wherever you live, I will live. And your people shall be my people, and your God, my God. While you two, you've said your vows of marriage to each other. You've acknowledged your love for one another by the giving and the receiving of those beautiful rings. I therefore, in accordance with the laws of the state of Nevada, pronounce you husband and wife. And what God has joined together, let no one put asunder. And now, sir, you may kiss your bride. <laughs> He's been practicing this part, though, huh? First, first. Ah, look at there. I'm going to pull this around. Ladies and gentlemen, I'd like to introduce you for the very first time as husband and wife. Libora and Ratka. Yes, all right. Ooh, look at there. 